What's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy Basil back with another video. Back with another fire sneaker. Today I got you guys another New Balance. So, this sneaker here, you can tell by the box probably what it is, is another collaboration with Salehi Benberry and New Balance on a 2002R. So this sneaker is already on my top 10 list so far this year. That's one of the best sneakers of the year. And uh, yeah, he went crazy on these too, man. That's all I can say, you know? Like, I don't I don't know no other way to put it. The details, the quality, and it's, it's all still there and it's all crazy. And uh, this pair I did have to pay resale on. So, you know how it be sometimes. You know, you wait too long. You know, you ain't, you ain't gonna wanna spend that high price. So, you know, I got it while it was low and was able to get them for a pretty good price. I tried online when they released, you know. Who do you know they got them? But yeah, got these in my size, size eight. My other pairs of New Balance, got those in eight as well. And they seem to fit perfect for me. So I say go through the size when you're grabbing New Balances. But uh, we can start with the artwork on the box. Uh, so just like the antelope cannon, uh, yeah man, so Leahy, you know, inspired by the outdoors. Uh, I think this in this inspired him from the Havusu, Havasu, what is it, river in Arizona? And uh, yeah, if you Google the place, this picture will actually be the first one to pick, pop up, if I'm not mistaken. I think I did Google it, and this was the photo that popped up. And uh, you know, he went with another quote with this shoe. As you can see, water be the God. You know, I kind of think, in my opinion, he's picking back and off my boy Bruce Lee, but yeah, that's another fire touch compared to the, the first release. You know, you can check out the side right there. He went crazy on this box. I don't know which one I like better. They both are nice, but uh, let's get into the shoe. So, like the original pair, we have that artwork of Salehi. And uh, if you're not familiar on Salehi Benberry, you can go back to my review on the uh, OG pair of this sneaker. Uh, just go to my videos and it's in there. I don't have that many. It's, I only have like 10 or 11 videos, so it won't be long to pop up, but I give a pretty cool backstory on them if you want to check that out. I'll leave the link in the description or somewhere like that. So you don't have to search actually. But yeah, let's get to the shoe. As you can see, I already tore the paper up, you know. But yeah, I did end up copying these from a resale site. You know, they don't sponsor me, so I won't be telling you guys who that is. But uh, I'm sure you guys seen the little green tag. But uh, yeah, this shoe. You know, if you guys can see my face, y'all will see how I'm smiling right now because this shoe is so great. You know what I'm saying? Like, so great. <laughs> but yeah, man, we have your four to be the gods. Get a good look at those. And like in some pictures, the blue looks green when people are wearing them, but in person they look completely blue, which is funny. And also this this in pictures give a little brown, brownish vibe. But it's honestly, it's kind of like a pink, or like a salmon color, yo. Like this is a great summer shoe. Like my next vacation, these are definitely coming. But uh, yeah, they come with the standard blue laces to match the shoe here. And then we have your extra laces, that salmon color in green. I think I might run that salmon color on this pair. I'm not sure yet. But, uh, so like the original pair, we have this Harry suede, which is pretty amazing. Uh, really comfortable shoe, man. We have green here. We have that little pink speckles, like salmon color speckles on the white midsole. Ah, oh, these are so fire. Honestly, this is like my first time really like looking at them and breaking them down. Like these are so good. Like I like the first pair better, but these are these are so good. These are bright, but they're so good. <laughs> but uh we have this green outline in here and a darker green here with that same hairy. I don't even know if I want to call that suede, but the hairiness that was on the OG pair and uh the fingerprint back there, the green fingerprint. And we have a brown leather tongue. Get a good look at that. And the whole tongue isn't 
isn't brown like that. Uh, the rest of the tongue is pretty much that mesh, that pink salmon mesh, but we do add another hint of brown here. And another hint of brown here. This is not gonna be a long video because this shoe is just like straightforward. Another hint of brown here. And uh, the insole is cork, also like the original pair. But yeah, man, these are these are definitely in my top 10 list for the year. I don't see them leaving the list. You know, unless you come out with this crazy all black pair, but <laughs> I don't see these leaving the list. These are definitely on gonna be on my top 10 list for the end of the year, along with the Bodega. Bodegas that dropped recently. The V3s, man, those are crazy too, but. Let me know what you guys think about these. Uh, I'm gonna get you on foot with these. Like I said, I, I can't, I just can be straightforward. It's nothing like it's, the, look, look at this shoe. This is crazy, yo. These are beautiful. Like the suede here. Oh, look at that. Oh man, New Balance. I don't know, man. New Balance has been killing this year. Got the 3M here. Man, New Balance has been stepping their game up. The quality is like insane. You know, I know you guys are getting tired of the off-white stuff, man. This is this is where it's at. But <laughs> yeah, man, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, leave a comment in the comments. Uh, yeah, man, they're pretty straightforward, man. It's the Leahy's member 2002R. Second release. That'll be it for this vid, my peeps. Peace.